Developing hypotheses and scientific questions are an important part of any scientific investigation. Have you ever wondered why something has happened? When something happens that scientists can't explain, they use their knowledge and observations to come up with a hypothesis or theory about what has happened. I know these plants got sunlight and water, but what else do plants need to grow? Perhaps they didn't get enough nutrients like nitrogen, phosphorus and potassium to be healthy. Therefore, my hypothesis is that my strawberry plants did not get enough nutrients. But I need to ask more questions, scientific questions, to work out if that is the case. So where do plants get nutrients from? And what happens if they don't have enough? These are good scientific questions because the answer will help me understand what is happening and provide evidence that will support or contradict my hypothesis. Looks like I will have to do some research and an experiment to answer these questions. I see nutrients are mostly taken up through plant roots from the soil solution and without enough nutrients, plants may be weak and unhealthy. I'm going to grow some strawberries in washed sand where I know there will be no nutrients and some in potting mix that I know has nutrients. I will keep all other variables, like sunlight and water, the same. If the plants in sand get sick, I will know there is a relationship between nutrients and plant health and I can add fertiliser or compost to the soil next time I grow strawberries. If I keep a record of what I'm doing, I can show my family and help them with their strawberries.